guys, welcome back to my channel. I am still in San Diego. As you can see, oh my chest just cracked. That felt really good actually. Um, I'm still in San Diego. I need to do an update video about why I am not in Nashville yet. Uh, yeah, that's not this video though. I'm gonna, I, I will film that video. I'm just hoping to kind of know like what the F is going on before I film that video. So we'll see, it might be the next one I put up, it might be the one after that. Hang tight, be patient, still in San Diego, my house is in boxes, it's wonderful. One thing that isn't in boxes anymore though is some, as you can see it's strewn all over my bed here, some, I put together some like really rad fun neon outfits for summertime, neon is in. Uh, I feel like it should always be in. I love neon. You know me, I love color. And this is a good time for neon for me because my hair is not colored, so it won't be fighting with any of the neon shades. Um, is that my phone dinging? I swear I put this shit on silent before I start filming. Hang on. It's my computer. Oh. You really suck. We're back. Okay, so this video is in partnership with Afterpay. Um, I have always shopped online and seen Afterpay on some of my favorite websites and just never really knew what it was and I just didn't take the time to figure it out until now. And um, so Afterpay sent me two to three items of what I'm gonna show you and then I actually spent a little over a thousand dollars on everything else just out of my own pocket. And I actually used Afterpay because I just wanted to get the scoop and see how it worked and it's actually really rad. Um, one of the founders and CEO of Afterpay is actually a millennial, which is really rad. So with Afterpay, um, what I, I paid with Afterpay on the website. So what it is, it's just four installments of 25%. So it splits up your order. So when you place your order, I had to pay the first 25% and then every two weeks, 25% comes out of your bank account, no credit check. And so it's basically like, like I don't know if, if your parents did this, but a long time ago, my mom would let me shop at Walmart and I would do layaway with the items that I wanted. But th with this, you actually get it in the mail and get to use it and have it. And then you just pay for installments of interest free. It's like, why not hang on to your money longer if there's no interest and no credit check? Like I was pretty blown away and I don't know why I've never used this before. I think I'm gonna start using it because every time I shop, I get a little crazy and I would just love to pay 25% upfront. So um, Afterpay is available with some of your favorite retailers. I will actually link that for you guys below. Um, because it's nice to know like where they offer it, but they're on so many websites, so you're gonna get to check that out. I'll link it for you below, but let's go ahead and get into this summer haul. This is gonna be summer nights. Um, this is basically the theme for this. I wanted to do some really fun neon outfits and whatnot. I had a little bit of issues with some things that I got, and not because of the things that I got, but some things I didn't get that didn't arrive, but we're gonna, we're gonna, the show must go on. So we're gonna film it anyways, and let's go ahead and get started. I love these videos so much. I love to see like <laughs> how things fit on the model versus on me in person, and I just got a tan for y'all, so hopefully the neon is like really popping. Before we get started too, I also wanted to show you how I shopped for these outfits because usually I just throw a bunch of stuff in my cart and have like a bunch of tabs open. And I found this way that I just did this like super useful. So what I did was as I was shopping, I like copy and pasted the items and created my outfits in the Google Drive, like on a spreadsheet or whatever. You can really do this with whatever. but. So I could remember like what the shirt looked like that I got and I put it up on my other screen. And so I had this available and then it's also great because when you get it in the mail, you can have this stored, whether you wanna screenshot it or put it on Pinterest or whatever, but you can remember the outfits that you put together with the stuff that you bought. Because every time I buy stuff, I like put it in my closet, it's out of sight, out of mind, and then I'll find one of the pieces that I'm like, how do I style this? I don't remember why I bought this. Like I had something in mind when I bought it and then I get it and I don't I don't remember. Like I don't even remember what underwear I wore yesterday or what I wore yesterday. Shit, my underwear on backwards half the time. Like that's what we're working with here, people. Outfit number one. This is basically like a, um, eh, a uh, <laughs> neon windbreaker situation. It's actually really comfortable. Um, I look way less cool than the model in this, but I still feel pretty cool. I got this um, yellow top under here to wear with this as well because this is kind of see-through. So um, 
You gotta put underwear on. Let me check this out in the mirror. Yeah, you can see my tattoos like through this pretty much. This is a medium and this is also, whoa. Oh my God, my new camera almost just fell. So this is a medium. This top is a medium. This is actually really comfortable. What brand is this? Oh, it's Stussy. Maybe that's why it's so expensive. But it's got a little hood so you can look really cool. <laughs> I look like a freaking like it looks like a freaking hazmat suit or something like you know I don't know and then these shoes right here are um, these are from Steve Madden they are in a size eight and a half and uh, I'm gonna need a nine in these they are pretty comfortable and these are seventy nine and ninety five <clears throat> oh oh and we can loosen okay and then. We can tighten. Don't mind my spray tan. I get a lot of crazy, got, got like a little crazy down there. Also, can you see my tattoos right here? I think I'm gonna keep this. This is like super, super comfortable. I might, I don't know if I am cool enough to wear like the whole thing together, but like, I feel like I could, I, I like this a lot. This is, this is very comfortable. I feel like I should go play some beach volleyball, you know? Here is the second outfit. This is a really cute little scrunch dress. Um, I don't know how much this is because I can't find my order and I didn't write it down. Um, this is from Tiger Mist, so I'm gonna go out on a limb and say it's probably around $80, 80 to 100. It fits really nicely. Um, I like this because you could have a flat chest or a little bit of something something and you're still good because it has these little straps right here. Oh my gosh, does it say the price on it? Oh, it does. Oh my gosh, it's $99 from Urban Outfitters, but you might still be able to get those on Tiger Miss website. I'm not sure. It makes your booty look real good. I absolutely love this dress. I think this is super fun. I think you can like do this a little tighter if you want it to go up a little higher there too. I like this. This is really cute. I'll definitely be keeping this bad boy. I like how like low cut the back is too. So I actually, I'm gonna just say that I think I kind of look better than the model in this one. I really do. <laughs> I think this one, I don't know. I think this one looks really good because I have such a crazy tan right now, but I'm gonna keep it. I am topless, but I came back to tell you that that was actually a size medium. I swear I'm gonna get better at these hauls. Like I'm just having so much fun. I don't know what to do with myself. I can't remember what I'm supposed to say, but it was a medium. It fit like a medium. We have the next outfit. This is also from Urban Outfitters, the entire thing. I love this sweater. It's actually really cool too because it comes with this extra thread. Like I never fix things when they're... So if you got a sewing kit and something comes undone, you're good. This sweater is a medium and it is super soft inside. It is $59. <sighs> and let me move you down to check out the skirt. This skirt is currently sold out, so I can't see um, how much it is. It's pretty cool, but it looks way better on the model. Like it's really long on me. Um, I think it's supposed to go up higher, but if I pull this up higher, it really doesn't fit. And this is a medium. So I don't know what size I need, but yeah. And then for the shoes, these are super comfortable. This reminds me of my childhood. I had so many shoes like this. These are a size nine and they fit really well. And these are $29. I wouldn't like wear these to a festival though. Like I feel like you would do that like really quickly and break your ankle. So be careful, <laughs> buy your shoes with caution. I'm gonna return the skirt because it doesn't fit me, but I'm definitely keeping this sweater. This sweater is like so, so good. I love it. Like usually tie dye is not like neon. So I'm pretty, pretty into this bad boy. I might even put some like patches on it or something. What do you think? Yes, this is what I wore in my Instagram post. I love this dress. I feel like Barbie in it. Um, I think it's super, super cute. It is very tight and very form fitting and shows every little shape, whatever on your body. So um, gotta be comfortable with that and maybe not eat a burrito before you wear it or, or do whatever, you know, whatever floats your boat. But let me tilt you guys down so you guys can check it out. This dress is uh, also from Urban Outfitters. It's $29. 
I like that it's a little bit longer so that when you bend over, you're not showing everybody your goods. Um, I paired some really cute shoes with this. I'm not gonna jam my feet into these again because they don't fit. But these are also from Urban Outfitters. They're by Steve Madden. I think these are so freaking cute. I put a picture of these on my story and a bunch of you guys were like, where did those shoes come from? Urban Outfitters. Um, but you can probably get them on Steve Madden too. These are a size eight and a half. And I guess on Steve Madden, I just need like a nine. Um, but these are really, really cool. So I will link these for you too. The next outfits are mixed between Steve Madden and Princess Polly. So I, this is a bodysuit. Um, I really love that the straps are, um, you can make these longer or shorter, which is always great for me because typically straps are too long for me. So this was really good. This is a bodysuit. Um, everything that I'm about to show you is from Pin Princess Polly. This is actually the first time I've ever shopped on Princess Polly. So I'm excited to try more of the stuff on. This is a US size six, by the way. And this skirt is also a US six. It is a bit big for me. Um, let me flip you guys down. This skirt is so cute. The model has it with like, kind of like a loose fitting t-shirt, which I really like, but I just wanted to bring some neon into this. Um, but yeah, this is just a little too big. So if I could lose like about two inches of this skirt, I think it'd be really cool. I like that it's a little bit longer too, so that, you know, you're not gonna be showing everyone your goods again when you bend over, but the stars go all the way uh, around and there's a zipper in the back. And this is really cute. I love this outfit. So I think I'm gonna exchange this for the right size, but I love this outfit. I um, also, oh yeah, I paired shoes with this. I feel like Bigfoot trying to put these on. <laughs> oh, let's go over prices too. So this top was uh, $32 and the skirt is 43 and it's like a faux leather kind of material. Um, and these shoes are Steve Madden and they are $99. These are so, so cute. Problem is I feel like freaking Bigfoot trying to put these on. No talent, big footed freak. Like my feet don't even fit in these kinda. Like just for your own amusement. I mean, <laughs> you guys have to see this. Me trying to get my foot into these. Like my foot is way too wide. Like I can't even, ah! I have been an eight and a half like my whole life. So I'm not really sure why I can't fit in any of these shoes. These shoes are so cute and so comfortable. I don't know, would, would, I, would the width of my foot be able to fit in a nine? I'm not sure, but I'm gonna try because I really would like to get these in my size. I love these. So here is the whole outfit. I almost fell over, but I didn't. And next we have a t-shirt that is so comfortable. It feels like a vintage t-shirt. Like it feels like it's been like worn. Um, it says wild in red and this top is a US six and it was $43. Um, I think the price is like a little high for what it is, but let's see what brand this is. Never even heard of this brand, um, <laughs> but super comfortable. I think I'd feel more comfortable with the top if it was like, $29 and then we've got this hot pink skirt that has like a little notch out of it right here It makes me feel very like clueless legally blonde um, This is a size 6 as well a US 6. I could go for a couple inches Smaller here, but I think one size down might actually be like I need a US 5, but it doesn't exist so um, This is what we got, but I could wear this it definitely fits well enough Feels pretty good too. There's actually like a hook and eye over here um, by the zipper, so that's nice. So it's not gonna come down on you. And the shoes that I bought to go with this didn't show up in time. So I will pop them on the screen for you and show you what those look like. But I really like this outfit. I think you could wear this with like high top Converse or platform shoes um, or even docks. Like you could wear this with like a lot of different things. So I like that about it. You can make it like more casual or more dressy. We have one outfit left and I have saved one of the best for last. Drum roll, please. Okay, here we are. So this top is so cute. I love how it kind of like comes out like this. Like the back is really cool too. So this top is a US six and it is $36. 
And unfortunately, the good news stops with the top. <laughs> Sadly, I wanted these jeans to be so good, but let me just flip you down here. So these jeans are by the brand Lioness, which I've never heard of. Um, it's very interesting to me because this is very lo like loose, but then I can't, this is so tight right here that I can't pull them up any higher or hardly like bend my knees. Like that's as much as I can bend my knee. So unfortunately, like the bottom is super cute too. Like I don't know if you can see how adorable that is, but it fits here too. These are a size six, but it's just so tight through here that I just can't get these to go up any higher. Um, and I have to say these aren't really doing a whole lot for my butt. So sadly, it's a no on the pants. Like, a, it, it's a hard no. Definitely a hard no. Absolutely not. But These pants are $71. So I would say they're not expensive, but they're not cheap either. They're kind of like in the middle, in my opinion. And I just wish that they fit a little better. Um, it's like, it drives me crazy. Like, I feel claustrophobic in these. Like, I can't move my legs, like, at all. But the top is really cool. So that's a plus. I like this top a lot. I think this is great. I also like how this is so high up because I always hate that little arm fat flap right there that everyone has and then no matter what you do, it's not going anywhere. It's so your arms can move, but it just isn't the most attractive in photos and this completely hides that, which I love. I have to take these pants off because Done. All right, so, oh, I forgot to put something on, hang on. I also got these really freaking cute mink pink sunglasses. These were $29. I love the shape of these. It's like classic, but still slightly modern. Like, it's like a mix between Ray-Bans and like old 50s sunglasses like that movie stars would wear. So really, really, really love these. I'll always remember the first time I tried mink pink. I was in Australia. Um, and I was on, was I at Bondi Beach? I think it was at Bondi Beach um, and I forgot my sunglasses at the hotel. So I had to go buy some. So I went to this like super cute little beachy store and they had Mink Pink. And I was like, what is this brand? And I bought the sunglasses and I love them. You guys might remember them if you have followed me for a few years. They were like kind of like big and glittery pink. Anyways, really cute. So that brings us to the end of the haul, you guys. What did you think? What are your favorite pieces that you saw from this? Let me know. I'm gonna link you uh, to everything that I wore in this video and then even more than that. And if I have time, I will do a blog post about it and give you like a picture gallery of like even more items. Um, and I will link you guys to the Afterpay um, website or, or URL so you can see all of the stores that Afterpay is available on. And I suggest trying it out. I tried it out before I even like agreed to do this video because I wanted to make sure that I liked it and that I was down for it and that it was like a good business decision. I look at everything from a business perspective, <laughs> sorry. But um, I really loved it, I think it's awesome. So I hope you guys enjoy it too. Um, it also is gonna come in real handy for back to school if you have children or you're going back to school yourself or Christmas, like Christmas, like that's gonna be, I feel like really a good time. Like it's always a good time, but Christmas I feel like is gonna be a really, really key time to be using Afterpay. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I will do an update video soon about why the heck I am still in San Diego and I will put that out as soon as I can, but hopefully you guys enjoyed yourselves. I think we did pretty good on this haul. Like I'm feeling good about it. I do have to return some things and get a different size, but overall, Putting these outfits together the way that I showed you guys made this a lot easier for me and I'm gonna keep those documents that I made so that when I'm going to get dressed, you know, for one of my summer nights, I can like look at it and just be like, okay, what am I gonna wear tonight? And be like, oh yeah, that's right. I have all that. Winning! Thank you guys so much. We will see you in the next video.